Yo, what it do? It's the King. Three stats to the masses. Grind time. Supernova shine. Get your bank up. Get your rank up, baby. So we back and we back to talk about some more X-Men. Now, the X-Men 97 has got shit on fire. So, you know, I've been going out to a couple of stores and like, bruh, like you used to can see X-Men 97 figures in there. Nope, bruh. They are fucking disappearing. So, but I was able to go in one little spot that people don't go to. They did come through in the clutch. But, man, if you're looking to get Rogue and Gambit right now because of the last episode with my man Gambit in them, um, yeah, those guys are pretty much gone and pretty much on secondary market, um, fetching a pretty good penny. So, you know. If you didn't get the X-Men and you was thinking about collecting the X-Men, if you wanted to wait for them joints to go on sale, I'm going to tell you right now, yeah, you're probably going to end up paying some higher prices. So Saturday, after I seen that, after I went to, to a lot of the stores, so I went and grabbed me a Cyclops from Amazon for retail. But like I say, man, like if you're looking for the figures, man, they selling not quick because it seems like the show is working and it's bringing people in to collecting the x-men i suspect maybe even children are getting their parents to buy x-men for them if they're watching it on disney but as you can see ken has accumulated a nice little um mutant figures and yeah i snuck up quietly on a nice little mutant collection right here collecting on the outside of gi joe classified so uh yeah my x-men are shaping up pretty nicely you know glad i sold them because you know most of these joints coming back on pinless tech so even better and coming with better better accessories and now now i'm filling the ranks with animated vhs and the x-men 97 plus some of the retro you know building back up my x-men so x-man is hot x-man is popping x-man is helping marvel stay afloat and definitely bringing some heat to the marvel legends so you know x-man is like the hottest thing marvel got besides you know team anyway so um was always hotter than avengers if you don't believe me just go back in the 90s because uh, avengers had a cartoon too now but nobody ain't really know it because the shit wasn't popping. You know, X-Men was the shit that was popping all throughout the hood. Everybody talking about the X-Men. You already know everybody was loving fucking Wolverine. So, but Cable was my boy. So, um, I always liked it that he time traveled and shit, you know, and, and seeing him running around on Genosha and fighting time sliding with fighting apocalypse one of the most powerful mutants the x-man face off and you know he's battling this dude by himself all throughout the time and shit so i just thought that was hella cool but but yeah folks um definitely if you're looking for them x-man 97 i'm gonna tell you like this if you see them in the store don't sleep on them go ahead and get them because i promise you you will not find them again people are buying them joints up they selling out online so i don't know if hasbro gonna do a second wave but um i picked up a couple of them joints i picked up the two magnetos i picked up the nightcrawler i picked up the wolverine i picked up the bishop I'm thinking about picking up Jean Grey. I stashed one, so I don't know. I might go back and get her later. But uh, Friday, I definitely went and picked up the Goblin Queen because, like, um, of the episode I seen with her. And then she was, like, just getting missing. And I didn't see her. But she was the last figure in one store. So I guess the kids didn't want her. So I grabbed her. And she actually really looks better than you know and hey she she really looks damn good but i don't know why they gave her that pinkish ass skin like she's brother love daughter or some shit like that from the wrestling federation so she got that red skin tone like brother love full of sugar and shit so but yeah um x-men is hot right now baby so if you see them don't sleep on them grab them 
because the the secondary market is is getting up there and when I seen people offering to trade for shit and Rogue is going for like $75 and shit like that, I was like, man. So I'm kind of mad because somebody put the word out about the $18 sale at Target with the Wolverine and the fucking Bishop. I was going to get me two more of them joints, but you know, since somebody put the word out, I couldn't get it because it sold out. So, um, yeah. Anyway, you guys, tell me what you think. You've been collecting these X-Men figures or you you ain't, you, you just been waiting for them to go on clearance or you just ain't interested. But I'm going to tell you like this, the shit is hot right now. So you, you cannot pass these figures if you want them. You better go ahead and snatch them up for you end up not finding any. Um, hopefully they do a second run, but if not, Y'all gonna have to pay them scalpers, eBay fees, and shit like that. So, but yeah, tell me what you guys think. Leave a like in the comment. This the King Three Stacks. I'm gonna be out in peace.